What is going on everybody? How are you doing tonight? I'm in the studio late night cleaning up and straightening things up a little bit because I'm about to do something that's going to be very, very exciting, very new to me and I'm a little bit nervous about it even though I planned on doing it from the beginning. That's why I got the front of the store and why I put up the display items and stuff like that because I planned on having people come in here and shop and I did not do it. And as of lately, I went and I put my business on Yelp, right? And when you put your business on Yelp, you have to give out a phone number and an address. I also went and got myself a business phone number. So I have a business phone number now, a business phone, a toll-free number, as well as a regular uh, local number. And my address is in there. So people are going to start coming to the door. So I have to prepare for that, right? So, um... With that being said, I have to straighten up in here and I have to keep all my shoppers at the front of the store, but I also have to keep the back of the store looking aesthetically pleasing. And um, I also have to buy some more little um, rack stuff and, and things like that so I can hang up some more items and display some more items and make some more items, right? But I thought to myself, when people shop, they don't just walk out with clothes. You gotta have to have bags for them, right? And um, so I was thinking about different bag solutions. So I ordered some paper bags as well as some cloth bags. And um, what I'm doing is the people who spend like under $50 will get the paper bags, right? With my logo on it and everything. And I got, I got to show you guys how I'm going to put my logo on there. And the people who spend above $50, $50 or over are going to get cloth bags right and um, these are the cloth bags that I bought right here now the reason why I bought these cloth bags is they're reusable and right now I don't know where you guys live right now but um chime in and let me know in your area are the supermarkets charging like five cent per bag for uh, paper bags and they got away they did away with the plastic bags right in my area, they should charge you five cent per plastic for uh, paper per paper bag, and they don't have any more plastic bags. So pretty much, you have to bring your own grocery bags to the grocery store. So these will be the perfect item to for people to reuse for groceries, for people to reuse um, when they're out and about. But guess what? You can put your logo on here, and you can advertise while people are out using it. So I'm gonna pitch it like, yeah, it's a grocery slash. Uh, shopping bag so people can put their items in here after they shop and yeah so uh, I want to share that with you guys and I know people are gonna ask I got these bags from Alpha Broder so you need a wholesale account to um, get bags and stuff to shop at Alpha Broder so I want to show you guys how I'm going to apply my logo to this bag and I'm gonna tell you guys this and I'm gonna keep on telling you guys this because I don't think you guys heard me the first time. All right, so what I'm trying to say is when you are in business to make money, the best way for you to make money is for you to buy something at a low price and sell it for a higher price. You wanna buy something that's quality for the lowest price that you can and sell it for a high price. Now when people buy these bags, I mean, when people buy their merch $50 or more and get this bag, I'm not selling the bag, but I'm giving them something that they can advertise my business with, right? A Dub Productions, my logo. Now, I want to keep the cost down on these bags. These bags are already inexpensive from Alpha Builder, but I want to make them a little bit better. So I'm going to add my logo to them. And the best way for you to add your logo to a bag that's going to be cost efficient to you, that's going to keep the cost down, is one color, 15 cent TKO transfers. And I got a bunch of them from TKO and I made a bunch of shirts, right? Promotional items that I gave away and I have a bunch more. So I wanna show you guys how easy it is to press these TKO transfers. And if you think it's something that you could use for your business, use my TKO affiliate link down in the description below. But I'm gonna show you guys, for those of you guys who missed it, how easy it is to press these transfers onto these bags and how they look 
and because the bags have these little pebbles in them these little like ridges in them it's gonna make the transfer look like something a little bit different a little bit higher class and i'm gonna press onto both sides of this bag so we're gonna see what it looks like it's gonna be one here and one there so let's go ahead and press i've already heated up my heat press 310 degrees for 10 seconds so let's press this transfer on and see how easy it is to press on here tko transfers let's go so let me start off by saying this if your transfers do not come with instructions on the temperature and the time then you're using the wrong transfer 15 cent transfer one color comes with instructions all right it's all you need all you need so let's press this on to the first bag so nice and see-through so you can see what's going on platinum is nice and hot i'm going to place it right here in the center could put it at the top but i think the center is better advertising what do you guys think in the comments all right so let's go ahead i'm gonna hang the top part off a little bit because it'll keep this transfer from making contact with the heating element and let's go ahead and press this down i'm gonna increase the pressure just a little bit i think i want more, a little bit more firm pressure on this all right so looking good right there boom all right Boom, look at that. Looking good, baby, looking good as ever. I'm gonna hit it off with a second press with a Teflon sheet. Let me grab a Teflon sheet real fast off camera. Teflon sheet, but look how clean that looks. And that makes that bag look so good. All right, so I'm gonna hang this off the side again. Guys, remember if you have like creases and stuff, then make sure you hang it off to the side because if you don't, your heating element might not make contact with the transfer and it will not press it will not press onto it you need you need that heat to hit that heating element heat you need that heat to hit that transfer so it can do its thing and transfer all right so yeah just press it twice to make sure it's nice and embedded in that fabric and then guess what we're going to press one on the other side too because we don't want to promote from just one side we want, we want to promote on both sides look out get that transfer all right so let me press another one on this side right here place that on here like here all right and after i'm done pressing this i'm gonna put it on like i bought something and show you guys what it looks like all right so that's good placement right there and let me know what you guys think about my idea of um, giving people these bags that they can reuse. Uh, I think it's a good idea because they can reuse it for shopping, like I said. And guess what? Now, now that I have my business number and stuff like that, I can put my business number on there and they can advertise, you know, for me. And as I begin to grow in popularity, look at this, second press again. As I begin to grow in popularity, people recognize it. Man, let me tell you something. Ideas, ideas. And guys, I keep on telling you guys, the best way to make money is to buy something for a low price and sell it for a higher price. And if you are making promotional items, you don't want to be buying high priced transfers. That's why I'm trying to tell you guys when it comes to transfers and putting your company name on stuff, this is your best option. My TKO affiliate link is in the description down below get your company logo your business name order a crap ton of them they're only 15 cent you can press them on to you know what? i didn't try pressing them on the paper bags but you probably can but look how good they came out on this bag let me put one on so you guys can see i'm saying let me put the bag on like like it's a pocketbook or something but you know pause 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 but okay so imagine if you got your you know your items in here i'm gonna you know roll it up nice and fancy fold it nice and fancy in a roll and just put them in there like that got put your receipt in there and you know what i mean for the women you know what i'm saying it's a little promo you know what i mean make you know what i mean you can rock that rock it like that too it's all good i mean you know what i'm saying with the eight productions it's all looking crazy right it's looking good right don't lie don't lie to me it's looking good it's looking good let me know what you guys think in the comments down below I think this bag looks amazing. I got about 30 of them. Definitely going to order some more. I just might say forget about it and just give everybody this bag to promote. But um, 
I guess a better thing to be to do is to put my website at the bottom of the logo, right? The name, logo, website right there so that while they're out and about, they can not only see the logo, get familiar with the logo, but also have the website on there. But this looks better. This looks like somebody will wear it more because it's, it's just like it's just like a name brand type of bag type of sorta. But if I put the you know the uh, the website on there, it might be a little bit overkill. But you know when the transfers cost 15 cents, you can play around with ideas. You can have both. You know what I mean? So or I can put the website across the band right here. You know what I mean? 15 cent transfers, guys. Put the website on the strap, real slim. 15 cent transfers, guys. Use my TKO affiliate link in the description down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I'm going to be back with you guys more often, give you guys little business ideas, and keep you guys up to date of everything that's going on in here and um, how it's going to be when I open up for the public to have people come in here to shop. Don't try to come in here and ask me questions and stuff. It's not going to happen. Strictly to shop. If you want to ask me questions, it's consult consultation stuff. So book a consultation. And yes, you're going to be able to come in here and get hands-on training. But it's not going to, you know what I mean? So we'll talk about that. Email me, stuff like that. So guys, I'll talk to you guys on another video. So yeah, what do you guys think? TKO transfers. Turn up that, crank it up. While I listen to the rest, we rockin' with the best, baby.